Well, she's given what she says uh, is her first and last interview to People magazine. She approached that magazine, uh, to, to, in, the, in the words of the magazine itself, to set the record straight on a number of things, not least uh, those claims that there was some violence on that night uh, in November last year when uh, this story really started to unravel. She says that is uh, truly ridiculous. But she talked about a number of things in that interview which will appear on the newsstands on Friday, talking about the disbelief, shock, anger and grief. She talks about the fact she suffered uh, hair loss and weight loss and insomnia during uh, the last nine months, saying, I felt stupid as more things were revealed. How could I not have known anything? The word betrayal isn't strong enough. I felt embarrassed for having been uh, so deceived. She talked about the fact that she was at home either pregnant or looking after children when many of these uh, things were, were going on and said that she'd been through hell uh, over those last nine months uh, and said that they tried to save the marriage that, but that without trust and love, as she said it, it simply wasn't able to work. She was also uh, not willing to talk about uh, the settlement, which has been the, the, the centre of much speculation, uh, suggestions maybe she received $100 million as part of that divorce. She said no amount of money can buy happiness or put the family uh, back together. Uh, she did confirm that she was planning to carry on living in Florida, and that was all about allowing Tiger Woods to have access uh, to his two children, the couple's two children. Uh, part of their divorce was that they would share parenting, but clearly both sides are having their say and both agreeing on one thing, and that is this is a very difficult time for the whole family.